is leaving your climate in manual mode more efficient. Welcome back to Northern Tesla. I heard about this on the forums recently, that leaving your climate in manual mode was more efficient than an auto. But first, if this is your first time here, make sure to subscribe right now. Just click on that subscribe button right below this video. I thought about it and it kind of makes sense. A few times I've shot videos in the car and I have had to turn down the fan because it was too noisy. I've noticed Tesla usually keeps the fan around three or four. You can even see after you've had it in manual mode, it immediately shoots back up to a three. So I decided to test the Siri out. As always, with my efficiency test, I have an 82 kilometer drive to work, which is a sizable distance that gives enough data and is a constant for comparisons. I did four trips with auto on to get a baseline, and then I did several trips with manual with the fan set to its lowest setting. I will keep the car at 18 degrees Celsius or 64 Fahrenheit, have one slice of bacon on the seat here, and drove at 115 kilometers an hour or 93 miles an hour. So the only variables here would be auto versus manual, and then of course the weather. As you can see, it was actually a good week with steady temperatures. I had four very consistent drives while using auto climate. I ended up tracking six drives with manual mode, then I eliminated the highest and lowest temps to match the average of the controlled drives in auto. So now let's see some results. While driving with auto climate, I used an average of 33 and a quarter percent of range while the watts hours per kilometer were 180. Now in manual mode, are you ready for this? As you can see, it does make a difference. The watt hours per kilometer were at 178. So just about over a 1% drop, which translates to an average range of 31 and three quarter percent. Almost a 2% range increase with manual mode. Can you believe it? These definitely aren't numbers to write home about, but it does make a difference. And other than that really cold day, having it set to manual felt no different than an auto. And when it was really cold, it's not like I was freezing or anything, you just feel it a little bit. Uh, maybe setting to a two or turning up the seat here will make it feel normal again. At the end of the day, it's not gonna make a huge difference if you're in auto or manual, but every little bit helps and it's a really easy thing to switch to. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up, leave a comment and hit that subscribe button. And as always, thanks for watching. Just click on the bottom below this button below this bottom below. I thought about it and it kind of makes sense. A few times I've shot videos in the car and I've had down and I've had down to turn. I've had to turn and I've had down. To, I've had, why can't I say that word? I thought about it and it kind of makes sense. A few times I've shot videos in the car and I've had down. To, why can't I say it? And I've had down. A few times I've shot videos in the car and I've had down to turn. Okay, go. Thought about it and it kind of makes sense. A few times I've shot videos in the car and I've had down. To, I thought about it and it kind of makes sense. A few times I've shot videos in the car and I've had down to. Why can't I say this? As always, my efficiency test, I have an A. Ah, my God, I thought there was going to be no bloopers.